Good morning, guys. We are going to start out with the Devo this morning. We'll do, we'll take attendance and then I'll give you your assignment for the week, okay? Listen up. Today's Devo says in Hebrews 11.3, By faith we understand that the entire universe was formed at God's command, that what we now see did not come from anything that can be seen. When God created the world, there was nothing. No fish, no animals, no people, no sun, and the list could go on. Yet in the middle of the nothing, God saw something. God spoke and created our world. That takes boldness. God had to see something that didn't exist, believe it, and then boldly speak it into reality. The truth about faith is that it's bold. Faith is certain that when God speaks something, it will come to pass. Today's truth, faith is bold. In the Bible, we have promises from God, so we know that God has spoken promises to us. Our challenge is whether we will be bold and choose to believe them. Today, you might struggle with peace with everything going on in the world. God promises peace. Will you believe him? Do you boldly believe the promises of God? Will you live free from fear? knowing that God has promised to see us through the issues we're facing in the world around us. Now, just to clarify, because again, I'm reading off the Student Devo's website, um, I don't really agree that it took, it took God faith to create everything. Um, it doesn't specifically say that, but it implies it. God doesn't have faith per se, because our faith is in God. And that's why it needs to be bold, because God is almighty and all-powerful. So why would we not have a bold faith? If our faith isn't bold, then we must think him less than he is. God is simply almighty and all-powerful, and that is how he created the world. I'm sure it does take boldness, but he knew what he was doing, and he knew he was capable. Uh, my challenge to you, though, is for you to pray with boldness, okay? So for attendance today, I'd like you to put a prayer request and I want you to comment on this assignment in the Google Classroom. Okay, put a prayer request. Now, if what you need right now is sunshine so that you can go outside and not go crazy, I completely understand. But I also want to encourage you to make bold requests. Okay, big requests. Things that really matter or are really hard things that seem impossible, I want to start praying for those bold requests, okay? Now, if you don't have anything personal or you don't want to share anything personal, look around, okay? There are other people and there are other things in this world that you can come up with something. So whatever God lays on your heart, whatever you come up with, I want you to put up a request. And I want us to be praying for those, okay? Um, your assignment this week, I'm going to give you a video. It's another YouTube video. This one doesn't have any annoying voices, so that's a plus. Um, it just has music, which you can obviously mute. Um, it does make it a little bit harder, though, because this person moves very quickly, and so you'll have to do a lot of pausing and checking what they did and making sure you follow every step very carefully, okay? Um, one tip, you may want to open up a, I think it says like meters and centimeters instead of feet and inches for your new document on SketchUp. It'll make it easier because they do not use feet and inches in the video, okay? Um, just one last point on that. I want to make sure that you are not just doing it mindlessly. You will need to know these things for your final, okay? Not necessarily exact sizes, but you need to know how to do this for your final. So please pay attention. Um, be diligent. There is a lot in the video, so you'll need to work on it both today and Thursday. Okay? Have a good week.